New at 10, a tow truck driver deliberately runs his vehicle into an SUV at a gas station in Oakland. He says he did it to protect a woman who he says was about to get robbed at gunpoint. KTVU's Amber Lee joins us live tonight from Oakland after speaking with the driver. Amber. Mike, the tow truck driver tells me he saw the suspects trying to break into parked cars in the area before they tried approaching the woman at the gas station. He told me he simply couldn't stand by and do nothing. I made contact with her car and I pushed her car all the way out of the gas station. I'm trying to disable their car. Andy, who asked me not to give his last name, says he used his tow truck to get the thieves in an SUV away from a woman who was pumping gas at a service station on Hagenberger Road near Oakland International Airport. Andy says he saw one suspect with a gun get out of the SUV and was about to approach her. The best thing that I can do is to try to be an American citizen. And that is to stand up for what's right. Um, and whether somebody's getting robbed or you need to stop and help somebody out on the, on the side of the road. And he didn't stop with hitting the SUV. Oh my God! This oh. video posted on social media shows the tow truck following the vehicle as it circles back and picks up one suspect who fell to the ground injured. He manages to get into the SUV with the tow truck close behind. Andy says he never hit the suspect. One business owner who uses Andy's towing services says he witnessed part of the incident. He supports Andy. For those out there who are committing crimes, should, should learn from this message that there are consequences for committing crimes out here in the city of Oakland. Andy tells me he followed the suspect vehicle to try to get the license plate. He says he went for about two miles before turning back to check on the woman who had been targeted. I look at that as being my sister, my mother, my grandmother, or anybody else. I mean, uh, no, no one needs violence in this city. Andy says he first saw the suspects trying to break into cars across the street at the tow yard where he works. He says he took these photos of their SUV and told them to leave. It appears the vehicle has California plates 6Z NC931. He says they brandished guns and threatened him. We're going to lay your old ass out. I was like, hmm, okay. He says that's when all four men left in the SUV and went across the street to the gas station. I'm sad that it has to come to this point, and I'm sad that, I mean, one of them got hurt. I mean, um, but how many other people have they hurt? The epitome of evil is sitting there watching some, something wrong and never doing anything about it. Andy tells me he doesn't regret what he did. He says if he saw someone else being victimized, he would try to help. He would do it all over again. Mike? And Amber, did he call police at all, or did Oakland police get involved at all in this case? Yes, they are. He said he did call the police after he turned back to see how the woman was doing back at the gas station. And Oakland police, in an email to me, said they consider Andy to be one of the victims. Mm. All right, Amber Lee, live tonight in Oakland. Amber, thank you.